Shouldn't be shared with me, powerful and humble. I feel. Rashan, which is a neighborhood, should know, and Ghost, which is 95 Sean, should know what the GF, as what there is in the air, allowed him to be from the three headed individuals of Mad B, 95, Amo, Bima, and Powerful having a mother. They read it. All faces show my probably the face I had when I was reading it. And um Humbo got to see it. There's a lot of things that it said and I just said it really doesn't matter because I'ma speak to Pal and let him know. I know he probably gonna be mad, but it is what it is. But y'all all got to see how I gave a letter. It wasn't nothing negligent and it wasn't nothing fake. Okay. Humbo eventually get packed up. He go home. We been in. I never get no letter from Pat. I never get no feedback. Oh, what the hell? Da, 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 da. I wrote him, never got none. He had a female named Samantha at the time. Sent her the letter, psh, made sure she got it, sent word she got it. Never heard from him or her again. I don't know, I'm still hearing from him. He's in the street. His chick that was coming up on a regular with my then wife. He out there going to see her. Time is going by. Uh, me and my wife got divorced. She wasn't acting right. She was tough. We ain't gonna be tough with it. I'm the toughest nigga in this relationship. You ain't supposed to be coming in. Be it. So, it ain't like I could have kept that thing rolling because it wasn't meant. Yet, it wasn't meant for me to hear from Powerful, I believe, either, because I never heard from him while I was in the system. Fan boom. 2013. Now, the boy took GKB to another level. He then got in the GSC, arranged everything after Black Omaco, after Robo Just. Powerful. He had to see. And when Black O left, he gave it to three heads for the history people that do know. Mad B, salute. Homo, salute. Powerful, salute. Powerful had at that time the most time out of the three. Homo didn't want it. He knew he was going home. He was like, nah, I'll give it to Powerful. Mad B, the same thing. I'm going home too. Give it to Powerful. Mad B eventually went home right after Homo. So while we out here in the streets, fast forwarding it, at one time me and Hamo got in a conflict due to my wife, his friend, and me and his relationship. Um, he was feeding a lot of narratives that was coming from the jail. And that wasn't, you know, females business. But since he kept his broad and his jail fizz. He allowed her to be able to be the mic to my wife. So I'm telling him she's not even his bro, bro, like that. And he just, you know, utilizing her. Just stop that. Take the slack off me with my wife. He didn't. It's like he pressed it even more. You know, he's very flamboyant and loquacious and broad. So he just got a stab. And that's what he did, which made my bro know a lot of my business. And, that's like when I got trapped off in Comstock when I could have been home in 2011. Um, two individuals get caught up in the system in my jail. One got punched in the face and while after he get punched in his face, he cut the guy that punched him in the face. Everybody want to go against the guy that had defended himself because the homie got cut. So the UBN homie got cut. And the brim homie that cut him, everybody wanted to be a riot. So I got 90 days almost close to going home. And unfortunately, I knew that these guys every day were saying they ain't got no weapons, no weapons is around, nobody got weapons, right? And the incident happened on a Friday, Tuesday, going out to schoolyard programs, trying to sneak some can times out, TNT bus come, come out at 2.30 wreck, 2.45. 
make a right, you get to go outside, 10 is in the hallway, everybody directed to go through the mag, try to do some trick for up the stairs thing, make it look like a clumsy, throw the mag cans on the side of the hats or try to throw them in the side of the thing. It worked, but the officer that went in it, looked on the side of him, said he seen it when he first cleaned him, he was not there, he was there now, get jammed up. So, when I come home, I'm mad at him for being a big man. I'm saying a lot of things, making her think that she could talk to me anyway to a point that I even flipped on her and told her, fuck off, let's get a moment. I wanted to fight that nigga. <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna bust your ass, nigga. He was trying to kind of like act like he was saucy bossy when he was in parole. Yeah. Hit this individual on the phone. I ain't mentioning no names. Like, yo, I'm about to shake around the road with this nigga, man. Finally get to see this dude. Boom, boom, boom. It is what it is. Dude's got me messed up. It's about to show the visuals. Southside moves different. And I'm going to show you how Southside moves. So I'm outside on the phone with him. He going crazy. Nah, bro, don't do that word. Mother, man, yo, listen, man. Keep it on some real right shit, man. Yo, when you come out, man, let me holler at him, man, man. Y'all two get together and come up to see me. And blah, 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 blah. And that's what happened. Pass the phone, fix the situation, the situation get fixed. We start hanging out, start talking, start saying my bad, trying to make up things. I realized that, you know, I shouldn't be getting mad over no bro, especially she wasn't my bitch no more. We give and forget. We out there hanging, we doing our thing, we running around. Skip all the partying bullshit, all going to the powwows, going on dinners, going to clubs. You know, a letter comes to the street. And when that letter comes to the street, the, the letter's tense and I'm like confused and I realize that I'm going to get to all this, right? Just don't use my y'all going to see, see through sad parts of this. And um, a letter come through, right? At one point, it was five of us. Hamo, Mad B, Pimp, CK, Shaquette. It's a reunion, but it's also a bonding, rebirth, the brothers uniting for all those around to see that if we're mended and allow ourselves to function and with the elite that have it and the family past that that's in it, it would be a good look for everybody. Cool. Free, being the individual who's playing an intricate part in it. He's one of the individuals that was going up there to go see the brother in jail, asking his opinion, asking CK opinion, asking my opinion. The kicker is when I'm trying to figure out, everybody talking about we got to speak and get together. So we end up speaking and we all get together and we out there photo hopping and shooting and we rebonding, right? Letter came out. The letter was from Powerful. So Powerful's letter, it was a lot of, you know, hostility. And I'm like, damn, last time I read it was hostility to I'm. Now what I have is hostility to all of us. He gives out a memo. Y'all know the memo for the GKB. So I say that to say this, right? It's been for a very long time space and terrible communication amongst a lot of individuals in the hood, 